Hey there, welcome to the third lesson of my series on rock drumming. In this video, I'm going to show you how to incorporate the crash cymbal into some of the beats from my previous lesson. If you haven't already seen the first two lessons, go back and check them out, and make sure to click the link below for a free copy of the material covered in this lesson. To start, let's take the first two bar combo beat from the last lesson and simply replace the first hi-hat stroke with the crash. Okay, let's move that crash to the fourth beat of the second bar and play it with the snare drum. Now play the crash on both beat 1 in the first bar and beat 4 in the second bar. Next we'll add a crash to the third beat of the second bar. Okay, now let's change the beat we're using to the fourth two bar combo beat from the last lesson and go back to playing the crash on beat one in the first bar and beat four in the second bar. Alright, let's move the crash on beat 4 in the second bar to the and of 3. Now add a crash to the end of two in the second bar. Lastly, add another crash to the first beat of the second bar.
And that's it for my lesson on the crash symbol. Hopefully this has given you some ideas to work with, and you can start adding the crash to your own beats. Thanks for watching.